Nature versus nurture, which one to choose? A dialectic, so it seems. So we take a look ourselves at the biosocial theory. First, we'll take a look at the person's biology. What things inside give someone increased sensitivity or reactivity? You see, emotions are like waves with up and downs and such. But for someone with borderline, they are sensitive to the touch. They may react quite a bit and stay right near the top. For the return to baseline, slower and sensitivity is hard to stop. It's biosocial theory, the backbone of DBT. For someone with BPD, borderline personality disorder in their life, and you want to know why. also played their part pervasive invalidation of private experience left a sensitive heart intermittent reinforcement of escalated behavior only leads to pathologizing or criticizing behaviors unrealistic expectations for problem solving too cause problems and solutions become too simple to be true Sometimes their home life escalated things as well. The behavior gets punished, or everything gets shot to hell. It's biosocial theory, a backbone of DBT. For someone with BPD, borderline personality. Disorder in their life, and you want to know. These things you should see in biosocial theory.